everybody. Hi, hello, and how are you? How are you? How are you? Hi, hello, and how are you? How are you today? Well, welcome. Let's see if we can do some warm-ups. I'm going to tell you to do something. You can do it forever and ever and ever until I say freeze. Okay, I want you to start with wiggle your finger. You can wiggle your finger forever and ever and ever until I say freeze. If you stopped, you're a good listener. Okay, I want you to wiggle your finger and pull on your earlobe. Here's your ear, your earlobe. Okay, one, two, three, go. You can do it and do it and do it until I say freeze. If you stopped, you're a good listener. Okay, I'm gonna make it even harder. I'm gonna ask you to wiggle your finger, pull on your ear, and click your tongue like this. Are you ready? Wiggle your finger, pull in, go. Freeze. If you stop, you really are a good listener. Open, shut them, open, shut them, give a little clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them, put them in your lap, they're in my lap. Creep them, creep them, creep them, creep them, right into your chin. Open wide your little mouth, but do not let them in. Very good. Can you do it faster? Let's see if we can do it faster. Open, shut them, open, shut them, give a little clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them, put them in your lap. Creep them, creep them, creep them, creep them, right into your chin. Open wide your little mouth but do not let them in. I wonder, can you do it faster? Let's see, take a deep breath. You ready? Open, shut them, open, shut them, give a little clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them, put them in your lap. Creep them, creep them, creep them, creep them right into your chin. Open wide your little mouth. But do not let them in. Here I am again. I'm in my apron <clears throat> with my dress on, on top of my dress and I'm coming closer so you can see my tummy. Um, there has been a holiday that just passed and even if you don't celebrate it, um, I thought we would just do some of those fun activities about eggs and jelly beans and peeps and so forth. So, <clears throat> I know no lady who swallowed a chick down it went so very quick, it made her sick. I know no lady who swallowed some jelly beans. Oh, those beans came out of her jeans, her pocket that is. Her, she swallowed the beans and she swallowed the chick, they made her sick. I know no lady who swallowed an Easter egg, for that tasty treat she did beg. She swallowed the egg after she swallowed the beans, swallowed the beans after she swallowed the chick. They made her sick. I know an old lady who swallowed a chocolate bunny. Inside the bunny was cream and honey. She swallowed the bunny after she swallowed the egg, swallowed the egg after she swallowed the beans, swallowed the beans after she swallowed the chick. They made her sick. I know an old lady who swallowed some peeps. They landed in her tummy in incredible heaps. She swallowed the peeps after she swallowed the bunny, swallowed the bunny after she swallowed the egg, swallowed the egg after she swallowed the beans, swallowed the beans after she swallowed the chick. They made her sick. I know an old lady who swallowed a basket, Easter basket. Was the Easter bunny upset? I don't know, I didn't ask it. She swallowed the basket if swallowed the peeps, swallowed the peeps if she swallowed the bunny, swallowed the bunny if she swallowed the egg, swallowed the egg if she swallowed the beans, swallowed the beans if she swallowed the chick. They made her sick. Burp. Well, I'm going to take off the dress and the apron, and I'm going to read to you a story <coughs> by Tommy DePaola. And it's called... Watch out 
for the chicken feet in your soup. I don't know. I want chicken feet in my soup. But here we are. And Joey says, now listen, Eugenie, <clears throat> my grandma is nice, but she pinches my cheeks a lot, and her house is full of funny old stuff. She's always cooking, and she talks funny, too. And Eugene... Watch out for the chicken feet in your soup. Now, Tommy DePaola's mom is Italian. They're, the family is Italian, so she does talk a little funny. And she says, Joey, mio bambino, how nice you come to see Grandma. Grandma, this is my friend Eugene. Uh, that's a nice. You bring Eugenie to see Grandma. Come in, Rigozzi. It's Eugene, ma'am. She calls him Eugenie. What's your grandma doing with her coats? She's using them to cover something up. How nice you you bring your nice coats to keep grandma's bread dough warm. It arrives and nice. Caro, come. You, my Joey and Eugenie, I give you something nice to eat. Zupa. Nice chicken soup. <coughs> it's Eugene, ma'am. Look! Just for you nice boy, spaghetti, manja, that means eat. Boy, Joey, you eat a lot here. Ugh. I'm full, says Joey. I love spaghetti, says Eugene. A Joey, you're not eating. Eugene eat everything all up. You're not going to grow up a big and strong like Eugenie. Eugenie, you come with Joey's grandma and help her make nice bread. Wow, Eugene's eating all of his, but mmm. Come bake the bread. We push at the dough. And Joey still hasn't finished. And now we braid the dough and make a circles and dolls. That's an Easter tradition. They bake the eggs right in the dough. And look at Joey. Still hasn't finished and I'm having so much fun. Finally, I'm finished. Now we put it all in the oven, we bake it nice and brown. <laughs> Eugene has an apron on. Joey, look what your grandma gave me. And grandma says, Joey, you take this home to your mama. And this is for you, my Joey. Because you, my special boy.
Arrivederci, Joey. You a genie. Arrivederci means goodbye. Hey, Joey. I love your grandma. Me too. I have some sheep with me. Making lots of noise. Maybe it's the little little collars they have on or something. I don't know. There they go. Oh, I always get this one turned around, huh? One, two, three, four, five. Five little sheep sitting in a pasture. The first one said, I wish Easter would come faster. The second one said, we've so much to do. The third one said, I think so too. The fourth one said, then I think we sh should shake our legs. The fifth one said, because we have to die a ton of eggs. Well, for those of you who did celebrate, um, there was the Easter Bunny. And the Easter Bunny does all kinds of things. He hops and he wiggles. And so I have my Easter Bunny with me. There he is. And so we're going to sing a song as this is the way that Bunny hops. And you can hop. And then you can run. And then you can crawl. And you can skate. And you can wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. And you can wave. So let's sing our song. Here's our bunny. This is the way the bunny hops, the bunny hops, the bunny hops. This is the way the bunny hops on a sunny morning. This is the way the bunny runs, the bunny runs, the bunny runs. This is the way the bunny runs on a sunny morning. This is the way the bunny crawls, the bunny crawls, the bunny crawls. This is the way the bunny crawls on a sunny morning. This is the way the bunny skates, the bunny skates, the bunny skates. This is the way the bunny skates on a sunny morning. This is the way the bunny wiggles, the bunny wiggles, the bunny wiggles. This is the way the bunny wiggles on a sunny morning. Now, I don't think he can wave, so we'll have to wave for him. This is the way the bunny waves, the bunny waves, the bunny waves. This is the way the bunny waves on a sunny morning. This book is called The Duck Rabbit by Amy Krause, Rosenthal, and Tom Lichtenhill. Hey, look, a duck. That's not a duck. That's a rabbit. Are you kidding me? It's totally a duck. Oh no, for sure, it's a rabbit. What do you guys think? See, there's his bill. What are you talking about? Those are his ears, silly. Are you still thinking? It's a duck, and he's about to eat a piece of bread. It's a rabbit. And he's about to eat a carrot. Wait, listen, did you hear that? I heard duck sounds. Quack. That's funny. 
I distinctly heard rabbit sound. Oh, there's sound is a rabbit. Well, you might hear him going sniff, sniff, with his wiggly nose. Now the duck is wading through the swamp. No, the rabbit is hiding in the grass. There, see, it's flying. Ha, flying, it's hopping. Look, the duck is so hot, he's getting a drink. No, the rabbit is so hot, he's cooling off his ears. Here, look at the duck through my binoculars. Look at those things, the magnified glass. Sorry, it's still a rabbit. Here, ducky, ducky, ducky. Here, you cute little rabbit. Oh, great, you scared him away. I didn't scare him away, you scared him away. You know, maybe you were right. Maybe it was a rabbit. Thing is, now I'm actually thinking it was a duck. Well, anyway, now what do you want to do? I don't know. What do you want to do? Hey, look, an anteater. That's no anteater. That's a brachiosaurus. Okay, we're going to sing a, a song to the tune of the wheels on the bus. And hopefully I can get these things separated. It's um, the nose on the rabbit goes wiggle, 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 and you can wiggle, wiggle your nose. The whiskers on the rabbit go twitch, 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 and go. The tail on the rabbit goes fluff, 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 and I guess the best thing you can do is go fluff, 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 like you're fluffing up a pillow. The feet on the rabbit go hop, 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 and you can hop all over. And the ears on the rabbit go flop, flop, flop. The nose on the rabbit goes wiggle, 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 wiggle. The nose on the rabbit goes wiggle, wiggle, wiggle down in the field. The whiskers on the rabbit go twitch, 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 twitch. The whiskers on the rabbit go twitch, twitch, twitch down in the field. The tail on the rabbit goes fluff, 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 fluff. The tail on the rabbit goes fluff, 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 down in the field. The feet on the rabbit go hop, 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 hop. The feet on the rabbit go hop, 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 down in the field. And the ears on the rabbit go flop, 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 flop. The ears on the rabbit go flop, 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 down in the field. Shall we do? 
And this is wishy-washy. Well, I gotta move back to stand up. Now, when we do Mrs. Wishy-Washy, Mrs. Wishy-Washy puts her hands on her hips. She puts her head to her brow. Oh! And she points. And there is, there are three animals in the book. There's the cow. And the cow jumps in the mud, so you could jump in the mud. And then there's a pig, and the pig rolls in the mud. And then there's a duck, and the duck paddles in the mud. And the best part is when they get clean, because they go wishy-washy, wishy-washy. Okay, this is Mrs. Wishy-washy. Oh, lovely mud, said the cow. And she jumped in it. Oh, lovely mud, said the pig, and he rolled in it. Oh, lovely mud, said the duck, and she paddled in it. Okay, let's get ready to be Mrs. Wishy-Washy. Along came Mrs. Wishy-Washy, hand to our brow. Oh! Just look at you, she screamed. Now you can point. In the tub you go. In went the cow, wishy-washy, wishy-washy. In went the pig, wishy-washy, wishy-washy. In went the duck. Wishy-washy, wishy-washy. Okay, let's get ready to be Mrs. Wishy-washy. That's better, she said. And in the house she went. Away went the cow. Away went the pig. Away went the duck. Okay, now we can shout this unless there's a baby sleeping in your house or an adult who has to be sleeping. Then you can whisper. Oh, lovely mud, they said. The itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain. Then the itsy bitsy spider went up the spout again. Let's see if we can uh, find the spider. I have a, a little spider with me, but he's kind of funny. Sometimes he doesn't like to come out and play. And other times he does, but you know, I'm gonna see if I can find him here. Oh, a spider, spider, spider. Come out. Uh oh. He's hiding. He's inside there. He's hiding. How do we get him to come out? Well, how about on the count of three we say, Oh, spider, come out. Okay, you ready? One, two, three. Oh, spider, come out. I see an eye, but he's still not out. Oh dear, what do we do? Maybe we were too loud. Do you think we were too loud? All right, let's whisper. At the count of three, go, oh spider, come out. You ready? Okay, one, two, three. Oh spider, come out. I see his eye, but he still won't come out. How are we ever going to make him come out? Hmm? Well, let's see. We did it loud, and we did it whisper. Oh, I know. Let's use the magic word. We can kind of whisper, because I think we scared him the first time. We just say, one, two, three. Oh, spider, come out, please. Okay, you ready? 
One, two, three. Oh, spider, come out, please. Huh? There he is. There he is. Huh? We did it. Okay, I want to sing a song, and I want you to sing just what I sang after me, like an echo. I am busy, I am busy, said the spider, said the spider. Very, very busy, very, very busy, spinning my web, spinning my web. I am busy, I am busy, said the spider, said the spider. Story hour is over, story hour is over. See you next week. See you next week. Bye-bye.